Hi there guys and welcome to this video tutorial for our uh, WordPress Pro Business Theme. In this tutorial I'm just going to show you guys how to create or how, how to input and use the short code for the font awesome icons. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just on the home page of our theme and I'm going to add um, a font awesome icon to this little strap line here so plus many more pro business features but i'm just going to put a little nice um, font awesome icon there so to do this i'm already logged into the site so i'm just going to open up a new tab uh, and edit this page so you'll see that this open, opens up another tab and we'll load the uh, the editor for this individual page so we've got that there and we've got a visual composer here so we just need to find the uh, section that with the row that we're going to edit and it's this one here so if i click into the edit icon to edit the content in this in this row i'll just wait for this to um, load up here so there you go you see we've got the the editor in here so i want to add an icon here at the uh, at the start of this line so i'm just going to click i'll click my mouse in front of the text there so we've got here if you hover over the um the icons in the editor we've got here where it says the pro short code so if we actually click on that there you'll see here now we get the the window with our drop down for all the short codes that we've got in there for you guys so the one that i want here is the font awesome icon so if i click on that there and then we just scroll back up slightly so we've chosen the font awesome icon so we've got two input boxes well three input boxes here so we've got the class and the name and if we want to put an animation type in there so what we'll do here first is we need to go and get the, the name of the icon that we want to use so we get font awesome loaded here so if, if we go on to um, the icon list here and then we can look at all the different icons that font awesome has in its, its whole library here so we're actually i'm actually looking for um well, what can we use here let's just have a, a quick scan of this page so i'm going to try and use i think i'll use the love heart it's just a nice nice icon to show the love out there for this theme so if i can just see that again i've just seen it it's the only problem so f a heart so you've got here that the if i click on that there it just takes us to the page but the code for that is f a heart so all we need to do here is go in here and we type f a space fa hyphen heart oops sorry heart so that's the the code for this icon in here we just need to put a space because i only want a space between the icon and the text that's going to be after the actual icon um, and if we wanted an animation type we could actually just put fade in here so we'll just select that icon so if we add that short code there and you'll see here that even though it looks a bit of a jumbled mess with the text that short code will actually put this icon in place so if we click the save button and then if we update that page and then once the page is updated i always like to to do live previews so we'll just wait for that to load and then once that's loaded if we refresh this page we'll now actually see the icon appear in front of the text so there you go we've got the the height in front of the text so we just want to put a bit of a space in between that so if i go back to the editor and then if i just edit that again and then within this text you can see all the square brackets that we've got here but the word plus is there so if we just put a space there save that and then update that again is navigate to the home page and just refresh that page again and we'll see that update with the uh, the space between the icon and the main body of the text so there we go the icon has updated and we've got the space between the icon and the text so that's just a quick tutorial of how to put icons within the text using the short code so i uh, hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you've got any more questions please don't hesitate to contact us at support at cmssuperheroes.com and we'll be happy to help thank you